Ooh, baby! God, is this not beautiful? Guys, welcome back. Welcome back to Primal Fear in the Crystal Isles. Ah, oh, it's so exciting flying around this stunningly beautiful map on this stunningly beautiful kind of like semi-translucent, transparent griffin. It's it, it's beautiful. It's majestic. I don't know. There's something about it. I'm so excited. It's so pretty. It's so just gorgeous. Guys, welcome back. I'm excited to be like here today, mainly because we tamed this guy up last episode. And today I'm going to put him to the test and see what he is truly made of. See what we can get out of him. See how much damage we can squeeze out of his big old glowingly beautiful majestic butt. Uh, literally. Look, you can see straight through his butt. <laughs> No, but on top of that, there is also something else. I've been given an inside scoop. And I know I said this yesterday. I said this last episode that apparently with all these eggs we've been searching through that, uh, you know, we'd be able to find out which is which and which one holds the secret key that we've been looking for. Well, uh, turns out I was I was given a little bit of misinformation, which is all good. These things do happen. But there is a chance, a very, very high chance that one of the eggs, if not more than one of the eggs from last episode of our Super Omega Black Re... Well, one of them might be the Super... Super Omega Black Reaper is what I'm trying to say. One of the eggs laid by our two Omega Reapers up here and our 73 Omega Reapers just chilling down here at the bottom of the cliff may very well be the Super Omega, super rare, shiny version of a Reaper that we've been looking for. It's exciting times, baby. Is it? Is it? It's, it's exciting times. But before we get into the action, if you still enjoyed the video, please go ahead and and no punches no punches apparently oh let's go old school then baby let's go and sign off with a salute guys go ahead punch that thumbs up make it rain those thumbs up so it looks like my emote mod is a little bit broken and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to help us smash through our goal of 750k subs by my birthday guys i just want to take a moment to thank you all this year has been an incredible year for the channel. I've never seen growth on this channel like I've seen this year. We are on a, a mission. We're on a spree. We are taking down... I don't know what we're taking down, but we're, we're getting subscribers, and it's really, really cool. So welcome to all the new subscribers that have subscribed this year over the last month, the last week. Thanks to everybody who's been watching, liking, just supporting, really. I don't Like, in any way, shape, or form, it honestly means the world to me, and I'm... It, it, yeah, it, it's crazy. I, I, I owe you guys so much. But let's get into the episode. we got exciting times ahead. Now, I've been doing a little bit of looking around our dinosaurs, trying to find my max experience potion that I know is around here somewhere. I just don't know where it went. I don't know where I left it. It's on none of my dinosaurs. Like, I don't know if I accidentally used it. I don't know if... Uh, oh, we did. We used it on that Udiranus, didn't we? The, you know, the, the, the one that died. No, was it the Udiranus? It was the, pr pr the, 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 the Prometheus mod guy that we tamed up at one point. I think I used it on him, but I swear we had a second one. I just don't know where it is. Uh, so I guess we're just going to stick with ordinary experience potions, unfortunately. Um, yeah, we got we got a stack of them, but that's that's all I got. So I was going to chow down on all of these. I've actually already given my guy here about 19 levels, and they've all gone into movement speed. I want to add a little bit more movement speed, get nice and high up to like 600,000, because, hey, if you got a griffin that ain't speedy, is it really a griffin? I mean, yeah, technically, but does it count? Yeah, technically, but no, it's not <laughs> It's not what I want. And that's all that matters at the end of the day. So what we're going to do, we're going to chuck a bunch into hell. Then I'm going to I'm gonna fly into the water and get uh, ejected from my griffin. No, we're going to take this guy out for a spin. We're going to see how far we can get to maxing, um, maxing him out. Um, yeah, basically, health is, max, is, is looking pretty good. Speed looking pretty good. Don't really care about stamina. Uh, melee damage. Melee damage is the true, the true important stat that we're going to be spending pretty much every remaining level that I have on. Technically, I should like crank up health to like 100 million or something just to make sure my dude here don't die. But uh, no, it's going to be damage. 100% going to be damage. Question is, casual trope just, just sitting in the sky. What sort of damage? 2 million already. Okie dokie. That's pretty good. It's pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Uh, okay. And that's just his ordinary attack. If he were to go ahead and say, you know, use his spectacular dive... Oh, actually, I didn't even test that one there, did I? Of course, he has his dive bomb that then uses, like, what? Damage is, like, 1.5, right? Yeah, about 3 million. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. However, sometimes these griffins, these modded griffins, do something special. For example, if I just dive bomb straight into the ground... Okay, it's just an ordinary, like, 
landing. I thought maybe there was a chance he'd set off some like crazy spirit bomb, like explosion or something, but nah, just the ordinary type. Nothing too crazy, but that's okay because this guy's crazy enough without it. So uh, yeah, we're going to obviously continue looking for celestials and demonics uh, if we... If we find them fantastic if we don't then it's not the end of the world either um but obviously we are collecting their souls so they'll come in super duper handy we also have whoa okay hold on okay no i was looking at the brontos uh brachios whatever that's a celestial allosaurus down there cool fantastic well i'm not gonna hold back i am 100 going to test out my lightning attack nice <laughs> pretty good uh cool how many le two levels now nah, i need like a oh hey big guy hello you're a little bit damaged. Um, can I, like... Can I zap you? Can I shoot you with my spirit bomb? Yeah. Yes, I can. Damn. Spirit bomb. Be mighty effective against you, dragon boy. That's actually kind of cool. I like this. I like this a lot. What I don't like is this big glowing cloud on my screen right now. That's a little annoying. Um, I'm going to lightning blast you, though. Or not. My spirit bomb's going to miss that time around. Die, Osiris. Fantastic. All right, enough explosions for the time being. <laughs> Let's just let them cool off. Um, now, this has been a pretty good spot for Celestials as well as Demonics uh, over our, our series. Are they? No, they're not my explosions. Is that another? Is that what I think it is down there? Is it another buffoon? Uh, wait a second. No, there is, there is definitely something down there. That explosion looks blue. I think there's another Celestial in the area. Yes, there definitely is. Have a look at that. Or is it a spirit? Hold on. Oh, it's the Necrotic Wyvern. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, 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 gosh. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Oh, oh, it's damaging me. Oh, that's damaging me quite a bit. Uh, insufficient stamina. What are you talking about? I'm actually getting wrecked right. Oh, gosh. Okay, okay. This is bad. This is bad. This is really, really, really bad. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Hang in there, big guy. Hang in there, big guy. All right, hold on. Okay, stamina's back, and we're out of there. Uh, okay. That was kind of scary. Don't really want to deal with that again. Damn, ne necrotic wyverns. They'd be tough. They'd be very tough. Oh, origin. Fantastic. That's the type of leveling power that I need right now. Where are you, buddy? What are you? Die bear, I imagine. A die bear? It's a die bear. Nice and weak one. 84 million health. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, the question is, can I get the easy kill? How much damage was that? 10 million? Oh, 6 million or so. So from one lightning blast, blast we're looking at 6 million. Pretty good. Not the, not nothing, nothing crazy to write home about, but pretty good. How about if I drop one of these bombs? Damn, what? Or so, say, why did I just unlock all the tech stuff again? Oh, that's right. My character decided to delete itself last night. So, um, yeah, we kind of had to start with a fresh one that I've kind of caught up back to where he's meant to be. Yeah, I don't know what happened. These things happen sometimes. It's like the fourth time I've had to recreate my character this season. It's been it's been a heck of a time, that's for certain. Anyways, th I think this is definitely the place we got to be look. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Primal Megalodon. I want to see how powerful they are one of these goes again. Can I just wipe this guy out? With yeah? Okay. That attack is ridiculous. Like, there's no other words to, to put to it. That is ridiculous. Why is my guy so slow, though? That's the one thing I got an issue with right here, right? Now, I just heard Celestial. Hold on. I heard a Celestial. I, I, I mean, I think it was a Celestial. Could have been a spirit. But there is a Celestial slash or spirit and or spirit out here somewhere. Also... What's that? That's Thylacolio. Primal Thylacolio. Hello. Can I fancy you for a big old spirit? Oh, that's what I'm hearing. Anyways. Uh, let me just take this guy down for now. Primal Thylacolio. You think you're tough, do you? Let me just drop one of these fellas in your general vicinity and wipe you out 50 million health. And I'm so scared of this attack, though. Even though I'm the one dealing it. It's the type of attack that would easily wipe out my computer. I've already crashed once today uh, before I even got to recording. I'd hate for it to happen a second time. So hopefully we don't need to worry about that again. Uh, fingers crossed. But why is my guy so slow? Dude, you got like a broken leg or something. I put levels into speed. Why are you... Sh you're literally at like 600,000% or something, aren't you? One second. Just a little... Little uh, side fight. 
against another brood mother. I think these guys are good for experience. Yeah, look at that. 35 extra levels. That's what I like to see. We've also got some more experience potions. Make it 39 levels. We got loot that I just do not care about. So just, just drop it all. Uh, 39 levels. How is that movement speed not doing nothing though? How many levels are I going to put into speed? There you go. 700%. And then the next 28, obviously, going into melee damage because that's all that I care about. Technically, what I should be targeting, though, is spirit dinosaurs. Uh, spirit dinosaurs are definitely going to... I mean, we could technically get a max experience potion and, you know, save ourselves all of that trouble. But who knows? I mean, we, yeah, we just don't know where they are. We could summon some in, technically. I mean, that would probably be the smartest decision, to be quite honest with you. <laughs> uh, but for now... We're just going to take out yet another primal and uh, keep the ball rolling. Keep it moving. As we know, this area has been notorious. There's another notorious spot for powerful creatures. So if we just cross our fingers and hope, we might actually be able... That's a celestial. Allosaurus, another one. Okay. Ooh, okay, we're going to be careful of that attack. We have died and lost tames to that attack, luckily. That didn't happen today. Otherwise, I'd be very, very disappointed. Very, very sad. Uh, but we're looking good. Is that a Celestial? That's just an Ordinary Rex. Never mind. But I have more. Oh, yeah. We got more levels. We got more experience. And that's what matters. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Apex Reaper Queen. Ooh. Also, I'm hearing primal music? Yeah, there's a primal down here. Hold on. Let me just try one of these. Why does that go backwards? <laughs> The primal bomb goes in the wrong direction. And now we've angered the uh, Apex Reaper Queen fella. Great. Fantastic. All right. Can I drop one out of my body again? No, now it wants to go forward. Of course, you know, when I try and shoot it backwards, it decides to go in the wrong direction. Um, Man, there's too many. There's too many particle effects on my screen right now. It's not good. But have a look at that. Done. Dunzo. Finished. Completed. Killed. Five more levels. That's all. I need more levels. I really need to find the origins. Maybe that's what I... You know what? We got the scanner on us. And it's not going to risk us finding out about dinosaurs we don't know about yet. Because obviously, it's just the same old origins. The question is, what do we have up and around us? Carnos? Di it's going to be diabetes, right? Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. 32, 31, 35, 30. Let's go get these guys. These guys are the ones that we need to be fighting. But my guy is so slow. He actually can't sprint. Is there something wrong with my sprint button? Did I break my shift? Like, did I, did I, I don't know. Something's not right though. I've broken, I've broken something here. My dude here, he's not sprinting. This is not right. It's not cool. I don't like it. Fix it. Anyways, it is what it is, I suppose. 30, 30 roughly though. So we're heading into the depths, into the thick of the Redwood Forest biome. Hopefully... Um, something pops its face out pretty soon. Um, I guess... Oh, hold on. I think we can just go... I gotta go south now. Just directly south. Alright. Should find this guy in no time. We just gotta keep our eyes open. Hopefully see those big old yellow orbs spawn in front of us. I'm actually surprised we haven't come across any demonics yet, as a matter of fact. Um, but I guess maybe there's just none out here. I don't know. Normally, I thought there's a lot of demon... Oh, let me take this guy here down. You flying leady boy. They're like weak to lightning or something, right? No, that's not a thing. Uh, why can I not fly straight? <laughs> we got there eventually, though. That's all good. Uh, okay. All right. 30. We should be like right on, right beneath us somewhere. I didn't see it pop up, though. Oh, that's what that is. That's the little honey cave, of course. Uh, okay, yeah. Like I said, though, don't know where I am right this second. Let me just double check the old origin diabellocation. Wait, one of them despawns. Oh, that sucks. All right. 36, 31 then, I guess. Keep going south. It's literally leading us. Oh, there it is. All right. We, we spotted this. Ooh. Oh, it's a Rudolph. He's done Rudolph's bad. Biggest tease in the world. Anyways. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Yep, yep, yep. There we go. We one-shot it. I don't even know what level it was. I don't even know what level, but we got it anyways. Unfortunately, however... No max experience potions. That sucks. However, there is. There is a broodmother around here somewhere. If I spot it, I'll kill it. If not, ah, he gets to survive, I guess. However, we did get an extra 29 levels. So I will take every single one of those. 
crank them into damage. Now, let's actually see what sort of damage we're dealing currently, all right? Let me have a look. Left click. 3.5 million. Right click. So, about 300,000 per tick. I still want to see how much we can, like, max this out to, though. Um, because there is some grand old potential there. Um, these dimorphodons are about to get wrecked. Ooh, 11 million on a direct hit. We can still get that higher, though. I feel like we've got a long way to go. I just need... I need someone with a bit of potential. I need someone who can, like, tank an attack. So, I reckon what we're going to do... We're going to head back to base. I'm going to head back to base. And I'm going to spawn in one of our best friends, an origin that we can just... Like, I, I want a high-level origin, basically, is where I'm going with this. I want the highest of high-level origins that I can possibly get. Uh, I and plus, you know what? We're going to kill these guys anyway. We really do... We need these sacrifices here. Uh, so, uh, what should I get? Let me actually check something really, really quickly, okay? If I wanted to take on one, another one of these, Kano, Kairuku, Spino, Wyvern. Good to know. Good to know. Definitely good to know. So, we can go to tier two. I'm going to summon in a Wyvern. And then I'm going to summon in a Spino. I was going to do it the other way around. Spino, then Wyvern. Doesn't matter. Both of them are about to get absolutely shrecked right this second. It's going to be beautiful. Um, but yeah, these guys are definitely the toughest. I mean, this guy here killed my Dodo Wyvern literally just a couple days ago. Uh, so let's go and avenge it. Even though we already... I mean, we already avenged it technically, but let's actually see what we can do. That is a big old Brachiosaurus over there. I guess it's just an ordinary size one. And if we're going to some... Oh, hello. Now we're talking... Uh, technically, eh, uh, whatever. <laughs> That's just an old, a good old demonic thorny dragon. I need the soul, though, so it's all good. All right. It should be far away enough from the base. Let's go and summon in the Spino first up. 145 million health. Can we take it out with a single attack? Easy. Easy. Absolutely <laughs> easy. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Uh, the Wyvern's going to be a little bit more difficult. Because it seems as though we have, like, amazing accuracy when it comes to, like, being on the ground. Also, oh, I was like, what is that giant beast over there? It's the dead. It's literally the dead spider that we just killed. Uh, Wyvern's going to be a little bit harder to hit, I think. Just because, well, he can fly, obviously. But uh, let's do it anyways, hey? Why'd you... All right, fine. You want to you wanna, you wanna summon like that? <laughs> I take it back. We can destroy anything, including Captain Black Boulder, the poor fella. Um, I don't know why he summoned in the ground, but I kind of like it. it. Gave us an opportunity to, like, just absolutely stomp his face in. I need to test this attack against something with a little bit more, like, I don't know. <gasps> Max experience potion. There it is. That's what we needed. 60 levels. Uh, let's go. Let's go. They're all going into melee damage. So it's time to find out how strong, in fact, we can get this griffin. On top of this, I got to give this guy a saddle before we take him into anything too powerful. Just, just because. For obvious reasons. Anyways. Nearly 5 million on his regular attack. Uh, lightning blast. I mean, all up. It's probably going to deal... Again. Probably in the tens of millions. Dive bombing. 6.6 .6 million. Um, oh, and then, of course... I mean, it's going to be a hard one to test out. But we'll find a boss sooner or later. That we can go and test that bomb on. Uh, the fact, though, that we were just taking out wyverns and stuff. Without even... Well, we're taking them out with one hit. I... Get the feeling this guy is going to be an absolute trooper of a boss killer. He's going to be amazing. So let me just land him down. Actually, can you sprint yet or what? Have we, have we worked out? No? Not really. You're just moving at your ordinary speeds. It's kind of sad, but what are you going to do about it? I guess I can sit you up here with your little buddy. We've got him maxed out. He's going to be amazing. But that's enough for you, buddy. You've taken enough. You've taken enough, enough, t enough time this episode. It's time for us to turn our attention to something a little bit more. A little bit more, a little bit more important, if you can call it that. We gotta go and find ourselves this Black Omega, 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 Omega Reaper. So supposedly what I've been told, I mean, not supposedly what I've been told, but what I have been told is supposedly, that's that's better wording. That's that's how you word it there, buddy. Also, let me just dump some of this useless stuff that we don't really need right this second. Um, supposedly, of these eggs, let me show let me show you something, all right? I'm just going to transfer them all into my inventory. And if you look at the left-hand side of the screen right now, we missed it. I was too slow. I was too slow. However, as you can see, there were two different, like, things there. There were two different inputs, right? That both said fertilized 
uh, re uh, eggs or whatever, right? If you look down bottom left of the screen right now, okay, you're about to see it. See? One times. That one times is, in fact, the egg we are looking for. So we really just need to very carefully make sure we get the exact right egg. That one. It's that one. This is the special one right here. I'm going to so lose this. Okay, that one. Is it that one? I think it's that one. Okay. So let me just go and transfer. It's so hard when they all look... They all look the same and they got the same... Wait a second. There was another one there. Or was it the same one? Did I mess up? Oh, man. I think there's a few here. Which makes sense because we, we literally have like hundreds of these eggs. Uh, it is not, of no surprise. Um, but is this the right one? Let's go and find out. Let's go and find out. Let's just throw this thing down. We're going to see if we have ourselves the super rare Omega rare black but i can't even remember what this thing's called i guess not i guess no it is it's a black omega reaper why is it red though <laughs> i thought it was meant to be like black colored not not red what you cheated me you mean it's just the name that's black it's not the actual color of the actual <laughs> reaper oh all right maybe maybe that's just enough maybe we just got unlucky okay maybe we just got unlucky Let's, let's try this out again. Let's see if we can actually get this rare reaper that we've been trying so hard. Okay. No. Oh, 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 oh. One of these. One of these. One of these. Uh, okay. Which one is it though? That one. It's this one. Okay. Let's try again. Let's try and get us another black omega reaper. Let's see what hatches this time around. See the egg. Oh, the egg always catches me off guard because the egg is black. I just named you as baby as my little baby as right here. I should go and correct that. You know what? You can keep the name, but we're going to just call you. We'll call you as just as there you go. Um, so we've got two of these black Omega Reapers, but they're not black. Why aren't you black? I thought you meant to be black. Supposedly though, these guys are quite strong. In fact, as you can see, he's a level 704. That is, that is very strong. I don't know if he's taken the power of everything, though. I reckon... Okay, you know what? We're going to try one other thing. So, supposedly, these Reapers take the um, the stats of... Well, the best stats of the Reapers around them, okay? Something like that. So, if I can be ever so lucky to get another one of these. None of those ones. Man, I'm going to have to disperse these eggs somehow. Hold on. One of them. One of these ones. One, two, that one. That's the one right here. This is the magic one. Okay. This is the egg where the magic happens. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to try and take this, this egg down. Uh, I should probably get an air conditioner, right? Let me quickly come in here. <laughs> Craft up an extra air conditioner. I, I, I don't even know why I went scrolling just then. If I go and take the air conditioner down here by the beach, I wonder if it's going to pick up the best stats of all of these guys down here. That's what I want to try out. I don't even know if this can be powered over here. But yes, it is. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Then if I drop the egg. Another black Omega Reaper. 691. You're not as high a level. Ah, oh, boo you. You can stay down here then. I don't even need... I should probably remove this air condition to be honest with you. Uh, we need to stop our Reapers from breeding now. Because... If I left that air conditioner there, all of their eggs that they're laying, they're just going to start hatching. And we're going to end up with just an absolute... Well, we've already got the army of super black babies. Um, but yeah, we would have an army of super omega reaper baby. It'd be, it'd be a little bit chaotic. It wouldn't, it wouldn't be good. It wouldn't be good for anybody's. Um, however, I don't know what I'm going to do with all of these guys. Wait, are you... A, this guy's at level 783. Oh, so both of those other ones were weak as. 704. That one down there was like a 691. This guy, 783, and then you can add another 300 levels to it, which means it'll end up at 1,083, which exceeds both parents. Oh, this guy might actually be a bit of a machine. I'm taking you for a spin. I'm taking you for a spin. I didn't spend three days trying to, like, hatch you very, very rarely from an egg for nothing after all. Unfortunately, however, I need to uh, teleport you out of here somehow. So teleport you to the desert. Hopefully your sibling doesn't come with us. Just you? Is it just you? Or did I bring... I brought you, buddy. Of course I did. Well, I mean, we could bring them both. Um, but I think what we should definitely do is heal you up before I do anything. 
<laughs> I'd hate to go ahead and lose this Reaper that we've been working so hard to get. Um, it's kind of, I like, I like the fact that we accidentally named our most powerful one. Kind of fitting. Anyways, uh, I guess I can give you a quick little boost up with some uh, potions there. 52 levels. He's a little bit hungry, but it is what it is. He's imprinted. Let's find out what sort of, uh, what sort of damage and stuff we're dealing straight off the bat. Okay. Left click. 42,000. Right click. I guess we never know. Uh, I trampled that apparently. How much health you got over here, big guy? I don't know why these do Oh, no. Oh, 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 okay. Sure, sure. Uh, okay, okay. Not, not ideal, but I get, hopefully we'll get some nice experience out of it. Um, cool. Good little battle to like Chris and our dude here. But he's not as powerful as I was hoping for him to be. Like nowhere near it. Oh gosh, my guy here is burning up. Oh good, we'll heal it. So it's, it's all fine. It's all fine. Maybe once I get his uh, levels into melee damage, maybe maybe he'll be a little bit stronger then. But uh, even still, his health ain't great and his speed is atrocious. Uh, <laughs> this guy isn't going to be like the dream that we've been like seeking, I don't think. Um, but who knows? 240,000. I mean, that's okay, right? What do we got here? Alpha Reaper Queen. Hello. Hello, derpy looking queen. Uh, you're a lot stronger than what I am. Why am I so weak? Oh, I need to put... I need to... Oh, man. This isn't worth it. This isn't worth it. Well, I guess the Super Omega Reaper Baby was a bit of a disappointment in the end. But now I have to go ahead and finish this thing off. Oh, man. Is it even worth it? Obviously not. But what am I going to do? Oh, I can actually sprint now, so that's nice. I'll just sprint my way out of here. Run away from all of my problems. It's what I'm best at. <laughs> do, 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 do. Get our butts out of here. All right. Oh, he's still chasing. He's still coming. All right, let me just... Uh, I'll just hide behind this. Wait, can I just leap? Maybe I can just jump my way. Nope. That's just a lot slower than running. Okie dokie. This isn't... Uh, okay, cool, 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 cool. This is ending up just a, a long, big old waste of time. All right, ready? Let's go, let's go. Whoop. All right, take me home, take me home, take me home. Come on, come on, come on. There's enough for coming for me. And we're out of there. Nice. Look, it was a, it was, it was, it was a fun quest to go on to try and get these guys. Unfortunately, it didn't quite go our way. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do about this, but I, I, I feel like, I feel like I need to just wait for this to spoil. I need, I need to get rid of these eggs somehow. Uh, pick it up. Pick it up. Stop picking up eggs, everyone. We've got enough. We have way more than we need to stop all the hatcheries, as a matter of fact. Um, I need to, like... Oh, gosh. I don't even know what i got to do. Three hours until all of those can decompose? I need to go ahead and, like, do something about this. Maybe we just send them into battle. Maybe we just find a boss, send in an army of them, and see, see what they're capable of together. Maybe these guys find strength in numbers. Maybe that's, maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's not a, a solo effort. Maybe we just got to spawn in a hundred of them and then send them in against like the Reaper Empress or something like that. Yeah, that actually sounds like a good idea. If you guys got any ideas for boss battles like that, like just crazy battles that you want me to throw a hundred Omega Reapers, because I got a hundred Omega Reaper babies on me right now. If you, if you got an idea of what you want, want me to throw them out just to see if they got the power to like take over the world, then let me know down below in the comments. But for now, we are going to call it a day right here. If you did enjoy the video, please go ahead and still going to do this one here. Punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. If you haven't yet done so, subscribe to the channel to help us reach our goal of 750k by my birthday. But most importantly, keep on smiling. Have a fantastic day. And I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.